Win the incredible Steigercraft 21DB Miami, powered by a Yamaha 200, in the ultimate season-long multiple species subscriber-only fishing competition, the Fisherman's 2017 Dream Boat Fishing Challenge. Go to thefisherman.com and enter today. The Fishing News is brought to you by Okuma. Hi there, Toby Lipinski for the New England edition of the Fisherman Magazine with this week's web video fishing forecast for New England. Well, first up, a little announcement of a new feature at thefisherman.com. We recently launched an update to our online fishing reports that allows you, the angler, to post comments and add your related reports and catch photos to our weekly region by region fishing news section. Simply select the appropriate local report from our homepage, click on the add your report button and post away. You can also add a related image as I noted, and as always, be sure to upload the original high resolution digital version. And you just might see the picture used in the printed magazine or right here in the weekly video reports. Well, as you can see, I'm here on scene today at one of the uh, many herring runs in the state of Connecticut. I checked this out last week. This is where I shot my video from. There was absolutely nothing in the run. They were literally just opening it up as I got here. Well, in a matter of a week, it is absolutely stuffed with fish. I was uh, doing a little fishing earlier today for some trout downstream from here. I couldn't get through the herring to get to the trout. So I moved up here and I shot a little video. So here you go, check it out. Right, that was pretty cool. Uh, honestly, I could watch that kind of stuff all day. It's amazing. I love watching the bait fish. I love watching what the fish are able to do coming up and down these rivers. Hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully got some uh, more footage coming for you in the future. All right, we're going to move on into the reports now. We're going to start off, as always, here in Connecticut. And uh, as you already likely know, as I've reported uh, last week, this past Saturday was opening day of trout season in Connecticut. And I received a wide variety of reports from across the state. While some anglers complained about a tough bite, Others limited out with these. Now there was no real rhyme or reason as to why one spot produced any better than the next, but with over 530,000 trout to be stocked this spring, I'm sure there are plenty of fish to be caught. And also Connecticut News, I got a uh, word from Captain Greg of the Blackhawk that he is going to be going on an extended wreck trip for cod this Friday. Uh, now it's April 14th. The boat leaves the dock in Niantic around 4:45 in the morning. Now there's still uh, there's limited space available. There's still some spots open. So if you want to get in on this trip, you must call and book a reservation in advance. And their number is 860-448-3662. And if you get in on this uh, trip, be sure to send me some of those pictures. Captain Greg runs a great ship. Moving over into Rhode Island, Saturday was also opening day uh, trout fishing in Rhode Island and for the most part I received really similar reports to that that I received in Connecticut. Overall consensus was that the rains of last week made the fishing a bit tough and roady, but with warm and dry weather this week, the, this coming weekend is sitting, setting up to be excellent. Also worth noting, for roadie anglers, the state finally set its 2017 marine regulation for sea bass, blackfish, and fluke. Really only waiting for uh, Massachusetts and New York now up here in, in the Northeast. But here you go, this is what they set in Rhode Island. Black sea bass, we got a 15 inch minimum. Season opens May 25 through August 31, you're allowed three fish. Then from September 1st to sept September 21st, it bumps up to seven fish. Then September 22 to October 21, it closes down. Then it opens back up again, October 22 to the end of the year, December 31st, you get seven fish. So a bit jumbled, but we will keep you updated on exactly what's going on. Uh, then for blackfish, we've got a 16 inch minimum. Opens April 15 to May 31, three fish a person. Then the summertime close season, June 1 to July 31st. Opens again August 1 to October 14 with three fish limit. And then it ups October 15th to December 15th with a six fish per person limit. Remember, on uh, private boats, maximum per vessel possession limit is 10 fish, regardless of the number of anglers on board. Obviously, it doesn't apply for uh, party and charter boats. That's for private boats. And then lastly, the big news, fluke uh, for this summer has changed quite a bit. We've gone up to a 19-inch minimum. Season opens May 1 and runs through the end of the year, December 31st, but it's only a four-fish limit. So again, 19 inches, four-fish limit on fluke in Rhode Island. All right, and then last up, uh, in Massachusetts, 
We got more freshwater news this week as Bay State largemouth bass are making another push to trump out the trout success that we've been seeing pretty much all winter long. Got word from Bull who works over at Red Top landed a really nice largemouth this week, and I got word of some other oversized largies landed across the state. Reminder, it's a good time to throw those big herring and trout pattern swim baits as the big fish are feeding on these spring favorites. The herring are, start, are entering the runs, as I showed you earlier here in Connecticut. They're also doing pretty much all across New England. Those largemouth bass take note and feast on them. Same thing with those fresh stock trout. The largie has a hard time passing one of those up. All right, well, there you have it. I'm Toby Lipinski for the New England edition of the Fisherman Magazine, wishing you tight lines if you head out onto the water this weekend. The Fishing News is brought to you by Okuma. Win the incredible Steigercraft 21DB Miami, powered by a Yamaha 200, in the ultimate season-long multiple species subscriber-only fishing competition, the Fisherman's 2017 Dreamboat Fishing Challenge. Go to thefisherman.com and enter today.